I'm Taylo, this is my buddy Mason, and we're going to tell you all about how to be very safe. Thanks, Taylo. I love being very safe here at Bare Metal Robotics. Let me tell you a little bit about pit safety and overall safety this in the club. We love safety glasses here at Bare Metal. Important key factors in safety glasses, always wear when doing work on the robot, and also protective eyewear for when you're welding. At competitions, you got to be wearing some safety glasses anywhere in the pit station, on the field, practice field, or any area with signs requesting you wear them. Isn't that right, Taylor? That is right, Mason. Thanks for that useful information about when and where to wear safety glasses. Uh, now we're going to hop on over to Tyler and learn about some tool safety tips. Thank you, Taylor. I'm Tyler, and this is Tool Time with Tyler. I'm here to talk to you about the essential skills and safety tips of using the tools in the shop. For example, always use the right tool for the job. Don't substitute like materials for another one. Like, do not use the wrench as a hammer, nor use the flat edge screwdriver as a chisel. Also, when using sharp objects or knives, always direct your cuts away from you and not towards you, because then things get messy. Also, if you see a worn tool that is damaged or dull, don't use it, and also don't put it back. Always bring it to your safety captain or mentor. All right, thanks, Tyler, for letting us know how to be safe when you get your paws on tools. Very important lesson indeed from Tyler. Let's head over to Eric, when he's going to teach you some general pit safety. Remember, stay alert, don't get hurt. Thank you. Hi, I'm Eric, and we're here to talk about general pit safety. Now, whether you're at competition or back at the old robot HQ, it's important to remain safe at all times. Now, ways that you can do so is ensure that you, at your pits, have a first aid kit um, filled with gauze, band-aids, hydrogen peroxide, whatever it takes to treat uh, just cuts and stuff like that. Um, however, in the instance where you have a leaky battery, for example, you need three things. You need sodium bicarbonate, acid resistant gloves, and a container to hold the leaky battery after you have uh, dealt with it properly. Um, so in the instance where you do have a leaky battery, the first thing you have to do is apply the acid resistant gloves. Next, you pour the baking soda or sodium bicarbonate onto the battery to neutralize the acid. Next, you put it in the container and you go to a hazardous, um, you go to a hazardous waste disposal location to dispose of it properly. Um, in the instance where you get a foreign material in your eyes, uh, foreign material in your eyes, you must find a, an uh, emergency eye and face wash station. So the way this works is you put this cap on top of the lid and then you pour this all over your eyes to get the foreign material out. Um, make sure that when you're at competition that you know where the nearest one of these are in the situation that does happen. Because not all pits will happen. Um, Another uh, great thing to have in the pits is a fire extinguisher. In the instance where there is a fire, it is very helpful to have one of these. Um, also, in the instance where you have foreign material in your eyes or you're dealing with a leaky battery and get the acid on you, it is important that you go to a hospital right away. So it's important during competition season that you know where the nearest hospital is. Thank you. Back to you, Mason and Taylor. Hey, quit hibernating! We're doing a video! Oh, my bad, Taylor. Thanks, Eric, for your very important uh, general pit safety. I am very informed now, and I'm looking forward to being even more safe in the pits. Now we're going to Bradley, and he's going to tell us all about a safety app! Can't wait. Here at Bear Metal, we have a safety app, and on it, we have our team safety briefing, our MSDSs, and all of the other first safety resources. And it can be used to start your own safety program. If you would like it, then go to the Android Play Store and search Bare Metal Safety. Thanks, Bradley, for informing everyone about our brand new safety app. Yes, Bradley, thank you. And remember, Bears, don't be hasty. Make time for safety.